Hi, my name is Felipe Gallegos and I'm with Aftermouse.com. We are a specialized developer of custom applications for the Samsung SUR40 for Microsoft PixelSense. So this is a very unique collaboration between Samsung and Microsoft and it uses optical technology to create a multi-touch, multi-user experience that allows you to also be able to interact with physical objects. So this differs between any type of traditional touch technology and the fact that it uses optical sensors that are embedded into the pixels of the display to both emit and receive information, infrared information. So as you can see, when I put my hands down, it's not just detecting a particular point on the screen, it can actually see the shape of the object that's resting on top of it. And that information is then passed to the PC, which is embedded inside the screen. So it takes this raw information, and then it translates it into data that our applications can go ahead and then use as information. So at 60 frames per second, it's tracking each point on the screen. And it assigns a unique ID to each touch point. And it can also track the X and Y coordinates, but also it knows the orientation. So it can orient content depending on which side of the screen I'm standing on. So whether if I'm in the front or the back or each one of the sides of the table, the content that I interact with can be directly uh, oriented to face me. And the other unique piece about this technology is the fact that it allows for virtually limitless touch points to really facilitate a, a true multi-user experience. I think we've, my record of, of uh, people I've had standing around this thing were up to 60 simultaneous touch points. Uh, the other unique feature of the technology is the fact that we can utilize these object tags that we can place on physical objects and program the applications to respond to. So I can assign the tag as, as tag number tag number zero zero, and I would program the application to respond to that particular tag in a programmed way. So I'm going to go ahead and run through an example that I have that we put together for Samsung more of a retail illustration of how this can be used within a retail store. Uh, we've actually deployed this in Switzerland and Austria and uh, it's embedded inside of the display of the retail store with all the devices sitting around it and you could just come up and see different product information, compare side-by-side -side products and you can see, walk you through this, so It's the uh, Samsung Windows Phone here. You can see the different an overview of the product, features, specifications, an image gallery. You can also watch videos. See customer reviews. What kind of hardware is, is inside? So it's a uh, it's an AMD processor. Well, it's a dual core processor. It's a three three gigahertz processor. It's um, it's got eight gigabytes of RAM. It's got a three hundred twenty gigabyte hard drive. Windows Seven Professional. So underneath the layer of surface uh, in the architecture is actually just a standard Windows Seven PC with an extra layer of surface technology on top of it, which is where these applications specialized for the features of the surface or the pixel sense rather um, actually reside. So this is an application that we did for Hennessy, and uh, the idea here was to not only showcase a new flavor of the alcohol, it's running for me, um, but also to be able to talk about the history of the brand and also some of the, the designs of the bottles. So if I go ahead and, and uh, select here, Designing Legends, I can see the past, the present, and the future. If I select the past, it's going to give me a history of, of you know, different content associated with the brand about the history of Hennessy and how it came to be. And the unique thing here is that I can drop any of these pieces of content off to the side right here so that I can email anything to myself or to a friend. 
I could also input a USB storage device and drop content on directly onto it. So in addition to that, I have a social media extension. So any of these, uh, this content, or if I want to write a particular tweet, I can, I can uh, connect to the, to the Twitter API here, uh, sign in, and uh, tweet directly from the application. Here we have videos. So this is also a piece of it right here is all the different flavors of Hennessy that they were introducing. So we have again Hennessy citrus and if uh, I can actually explore some, some easy to make recipes for drinks that they recommend. And each one of these recipes can be shared to Facebook. Cool.